Okay, so the builder pattern use case example. I'll use the builder pattern in the context of a house builder. I'll create several directors, which will create different representations, but using the same builder class, which is the house builder class down here. These are the different directors, igloo, castle, houseboat, director. They will use the house builder in different combinations with different parameters, and they'll produce a product, which is a house, which will be different depending on whichever director was used. So the code, it will be source builder client TS first. Okay, source builder client TS. I have three directors, all their own TypeScript file, houseboat and igloo. I'll create an igloo, igloo director construct, castle director construct, console log igloo construction. This is a method that will output a string describing the construction of the igloo, castle and houseboat. So from the client perspective, it's not complicated at all. Let's look at one of the directors. So the castle director, okay, imports house, that's the product, house builder, that's the builder class. There's the construct method, it's a static method, house returns a new house builder, set building type castle, etc. These are the methods provided by the house builder. With different parameters. If I look at the igloo director, we'll see the igloo director doesn't call all the methods. It has excluded set the number of windows. The igloo doesn't have windows. Okay, and if we look at the houseboat director, different parameters once again. Now each of these methods can be called in a different order. It doesn't really matter. You should aim for that when creating your builder class, that possibility of any number of order or a number of combinations or even potentially nothing at all, just a default product okay so let's look at the house itself which is the product it has four properties doors windows wall material and building type i haven't described the type being number here it's automatically inferred because it's instantiated when i declare it wall material it's automatically inferred as a string because i instantiate it as a string when i declare it okay so there's the construction method returns a string and it's using a template string here it's returning a string containing whatever the value of this wall material this building type this door etc equals and there we go there's the client console logging igloo construction which returns a string okay so we can run that it's automatically built because i'm running tsc in watch mode node dist builder client js there we go okay so here these three lines this is a ice igloo with one doors and zero windows this is a sandstone castle with 100 doors and 200 windows etc they use the same house builder but use different directors to create those different representations summary the builder pattern is a creational pattern that is used to create more complex objects than you'd expect from a factory the builder pattern should be able to construct complex objects in any order and include exclude whichever available components it likes the different combinations of products that can be returned from a builder use a specific director to create the bespoke combination you can use an abstract factory to add an abstraction between the client and the director okay and finally let's analyze the code just a little bit more if we look at the builder concept code again from the first video in each of these build methods i'm returning this so build part a returns a reference to this actual instance of the builder same with build part b and c because it's returning this that allows me to later string the methods together as i do like this using the dots so build part a dot build part c for example dot build part b for example or even leave one out that's because it's returning a reference to this so the function there is getting back a reference to the builder so it can then use the next methods so if i took this away so build part a and i didn't return this anymore but i just returned void so i'm going to put that as void like that you can no longer string the methods together like that using the dots so no options are there so that's the purpose of returning this after the method there and if i go back down there we go build part a build part c get result i can even build part b again dot then build part c excellent and that was the same in the castle director here i'm using the same technique houseboat director etc and the igloo director excellent in the next section we'll look at the prototype design pattern Excellent.